2,000 years ago, the Romans built roads and aqueducts so precise that many still stand today, defying the passage of centuries. Their secret wasn't just brute strength, but a genius understanding of materials, terrain, and maintenance. Every road was constructed in multiple layers, large stones at the base for stability, gravel for drainage, and tightly packed sand to create a smooth, enduring surface. The surface itself was crowned slightly in the middle, allowing rainwater to flow to the sides, preventing erosion and rot. This wasn't mere transportation, it was a lifeline for commerce, communication, and military dominance. The aqueducts, perhaps even more remarkable, carried fresh water from distant springs and mountains into the heart of cities. They relied purely on the force of gravity, descending at such a gentle slope that the drop was almost imperceptible to the naked eye. Miles of arches allowed these structures to cross valleys and rivers without losing stability, each arch reducing weight while distributing force evenly. Inside, channels were lined with a special waterproof mortar that kept the water pure and the structure sound. Together, these feats formed the veins and arteries of the Roman Empire. Roads moved legions, merchants, and ideas. Aqueducts brought health, sanitation, and prosperity. They transformed barren land into thriving centers of civilization. And though the empire itself crumbled, the stones remain. A silent testimony to an age when human ambition dared to build, not just for the present, but for eternity.